A big shout out to Private Internet Access for sponsoring today's video. In today's digital world, your personal information is constantly at risk. Hackers, ISPs, and even governments can track your every move online, but VPN is a solution. A VPN hides your IP address and encrypts your internet connection, protecting your online activities from being viewed by third parties. The world's best VPN provider today is Private Internet Access, which has over 30 million downloads. It was established with the aim of offering individuals a secure and private online browsing experience. Picture this. Browsing online without private internet access is like writing a personal letter on a postcard for everyone to read, while using PIA is like sealing that letter in an envelope and sending it securely, ensuring only the intended recipient can access its contents. Also, are you tired of browsing the internet with restrictions, yearning for a world with unlimited possibilities? Guess what? The incredible Harry Potter series is missing from the US Netflix library. But fear not. With private internet access, a whole new streaming universe awaits. Just a click away, you can transport yourself to Netflix Japan or Netflix Australia. Unlock endless entertainment with PIA. Protect unlimited devices simultaneously with a single PIA subscription. For a limited time, sign up now to enjoy an incredible 83% discount on your subscription. Plus, get four months completely free. Don't miss out on this unbeatable deal. Take control of your streaming experience with private internet access. The Next Generation Squad Weapon NGSW program is the United States Army initiative to develop and procure a new set of individual weapons to replace the aging 5.56mm M4 carbine, M249 saw light machine gun, and 7.62mm M240 machine gun used by infantry squads. The NGSW program aims to provide soldiers with enhanced lethality, accuracy, and overall performance on the battlefield. The program was expected to cost $10 million in the first year of production and won $50 million in the next. The companies that will develop the weapons to be a part of the Next Generation Squad Weapon NGSW program are Six Sauer and Vortex Optics. Let's check out the list of the weapons produced by these companies. XM7 Previously known as the XM5, this is designed and manufactured by Six Sauer, a well-known firearms company. One notable feature of the XM7 is its chambering for a specific cartridge, the 6.851mm or 277 caliber. This cartridge is slightly larger than the standard 5.56-45mm cartridge used in the M4 carbine and is intended to provide improved performance and stopping power. This gas-operated magazine-fed assault rifle includes a free-floating reinforced M-Lock handguard. In late 2023, the U.S. Army plans to receive the first batch of 25 XM7 rifles. The Army has a procurement plan to acquire a total of 107,000 XM7 rifles for these roles. The XM7 rifle weighs 8.38 pounds, 3.80 kilograms without a suppressor, and 9.84 pounds, 4.46 kilograms with a suppressor attached. It utilizes SR25 pattern magazine, which can hold 20 rounds in a box magazine. Additionally, there is an optional 25-round box magazine available for use. Overall, the XM7 is intended to offer advancements in firepower, reliability, and adaptability compared to the M4 carbine, making it a potential candidate for the U.S. Army's next-generation squad weapon program. The XM250 This is a light machine gun designed again by Six Sauer. It is intended to replace the M249 light machine gun. The XM250 is gas-operated and belt-fed, using a 6.851mm cartridge. Similar to the XM7 rifle, the XM250 also features a free-floating reinforced M-lock handguard with negative space or hollow slot mounting points. This handguard allows for direct attachment of accessories, such as optics or grips, to enhance the functionality and customization options of the machine gun. It weighs 13 pounds, 5.9 kilograms, with a suppressor attached. Compared to the M249 light machine gun, the XM250 is lighter, weighing about 4 pounds, 1.8 kilogram less. However, the gunner carrying the XM250 carries a slightly heavier load, about 1 point more, with 200 fewer rounds of ammunition. Vortex Optics XM157 
The Vortex Optics XM157 is a technologically advanced optic designed to meet the needs of current and future warfighters. It is a low-powered variable optic LPVO, that incorporates multiple features to enhance its functionality on the battlefield. It will serve as the fire control for the next-generation squad weapons, and the XM157 is a 1 to 8 30 LPVO with the glass edge reticle and various integrated components. The Vortex Optics XM157 is unique because it features a full display with pixels. Instead of only illuminating specific spots to create reticles, the display overlays information on top of the optical image from the scope. This provides the shooter with numerous options such as ballistic drop compensation, wind holds, range to the target, menus, augmented reality, waypoints, and other customizable features as desired by the Army. In summary, the XM157 optic offers a versatile, customizable display system that enhances the shooter's capabilities by providing a wide range of information and options directly within their sight picture. It appears that all XM7 rifles will be equipped with this optic. The optic can also be used with any rifle, as long as there is ballistics data for the rifle and rounds. 6.851 Sig Fury In April 2022, with the selection of MCX Spare, the 6 hours hybrid metal cartridge would become the new cartridge subsequently referred to as 6.851mm common cartridge by the US Army. This is a centerfire, rimless, bottlenecked rifle cartridge. Its hybrid three-piece cartridge case has a steel case head and brass body connected by an aluminium locking washer to support the high chamber pressure of 80,000 PSI. Six Hour claims that the cartridge has performance superior to the 6.5mm Crete Moore, exhibiting 6 to 9 feet less bullet drop at 1,000 yards while delivering 20 to 25% greater energy. Operational testing of the XM7 rifle, XM250 automatic rifle, XM157 fire control optic platform agnostic unit, and the 6.851mm ammunition squad weaponry is expected to begin in 2024.